The man, the myth, the villain. Hello Star Wars fans, my name is Joel Robinson, and this is the 16 day video countdown to Rogue One. Orson Krennic was born 51 years before the Battle of Yavin, and quickly became one of the highest ranking officials in the Galactic Empire. Many would describe him as extremely unpredictable and volatile. After the capture of the Urso family by the Separatists, it is Krennic who rescues Galen and his family, thus making Galen in debt to Krennic for many, many years. Director Krennic offers Galen an extraordinary opportunity to continue his scientific studies with every resource at his disposal. The Ursals believe that Galen's research will be used in purely altruistic ways. Krennic, on the other hand, has plans to finally finish the Death Star. Krennic serves as the director of the Advanced Weapons Research Division of the Imperial Military during the time of the Galactic Civil War. He was responsible for the security of the Death Star project, and it is he who commands a squad of Death Troopers, which he wields as a weapon primarily against the Rebels. Clad in a white uniform similar to that worn by members of Imperial security and similar to the one worn by Colonel Wolf Yolaren, Director Krennic sought the favor of Emperor Palpatine. He did that by using his vast knowledge of Imperial systems to manipulate and ascend the Imperial hierarchy. To learn more about Krennic's Death Troopers, come back tomorrow for another video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you need more Star Wars, and a special thank you to Zach Ulrich who wrote this video for me. Be sure to check out his YouTube channel, link below. And as always, may the Force be with you.